What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have another video for you guys. I know it has been a little bit since my last post. I'm sorry for that, but I'm hoping that this video will make that up because today we have two exciting things. Number one, it's not as exciting, but super duper exciting. I have my microphone situation pretty much worked out for now at least. I have my microphone right here. This is what I'm going to be using, not these to record my uh my voice anymore i used to use these to record my voice now i'm using this it's pretty much going to sound the same but it's going to be a lot easier for me to record thus making me able to make more content for you guys and secondly whew, this is a big secondly this is a very very good secondly we have this right here a samsung 128 gigabyte usb 3.1 flash drive now this doesn't make as big a sense to you guys right now, probably, until you realize that my console of choice is, in fact, an Xbox. Now, now you see where I'm going with this? So what this flash drive will allow me to do is play video games on my Xbox and finally be able to record them. So I've been wanting to do this for a while now. I'm still saving up for my own Xbox. Right now I'm just using my family's Xbox, but I got tons of stuff on there anyway. And it should be just as good as having my old console. I am still looking out for a new Series X though. That thing would be kind of cool to own. But without further ado, I think today we're going to be playing some SnowRunner. So let's buckle up and start our engines because we're ready to go. Alrighty guys, well I have played SnowRunner before, but I've never completely played it, you know how. Uh, but I've never completed it or got that far in it, so I'm excited to be able to finally play it with you guys. So let's go ahead and start a new game. We'll do a new campaign so that we can go ahead and start over. So slot three, that is perfect. See, farthest I ever got was 4% in, and I think that one was with mods, I'm pretty sure. All right, thank you for joining our recovery and maintenance effort at the devastating flood. We need all the help to repair the bridge that collapsed. So let's go ahead and prepare, or uh, repair the bridge. So first we need to find a watchtower. So let's go ahead and uh, find that watchtower then. All right, so remove the handbrake, and then we can start the engine. Always scout new areas. Press that to open the map. Ooh, nice map. It's a very, very nice map. Let's go find that watchtower, shall we? Let's, um, which button is it? It's select marker. Wait, what do we... Oh, there we go. Let's go to the watchtower, guys. So we're going to go ahead and start driving. Ooh. Okay, all-wheel drive is... LB. No, LB. LB and X. All right. It's LB and X for all-wheel drive. Good. I'll definitely need to know that. So we can, when driving through rough terrain, you can switch to low gear. All right, cool. That sounds good. So let's go ahead and switch to the low gear. And let's also switch it to all wheel drive. There we go. Let's switch it back from low gear. All right, cool. Sounds good. Sounds good to me. Let's get out of all wheel drive because it has massive fuel consumption. So let's wait till we get on the paved road before we switch out of all wheel drive because we're gonna want all wheel drive in the mud. All right, cool. Oh, this truck is super slidey. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Dang. Ouch. When you damage your vehicle, you can open the function menu to get more. Uh, information about damaged parts. Yeah, this truck is super slidey. We might want to turn on all-wheel drive. Yeah, that's definitely better. Now it's definitely not as slidey anymore. I just wish it didn't have massive fuel consumption. Fuel consumption. We did that, but I mean it's realistic, so I like that better. Oh, oh, oh! Chill, 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 guys. Chill. Let's go at more of a cruising speed, shall we? 
You will encounter different kinds of terrain. Alright, cool. You found a different types of terrain from that. We're gonna go straight through this. Because we are rebels. Oh. <laughs> I thought we were gonna get stuck for a second there. Alright, there you go, bud. Good job. You made it through. Alright, let's go and find this watchtower, shall we? Alright, this is where you can get stuck pretty bad. If I remember from the last tutorial. So let's not get stuck. Yikes. It's definitely super slidey. There's that. Cabin view. Ooh, I like my gold ring. I never noticed that before. Watchtower? Beautiful. Alright, we are at the watchtower. Good job, discovered watchtower. Launch the operation. Beautiful. Look at that scene. There's a little truck down there. Alright, upgrade location discovered. Now we gotta go down there, I'm pretty sure. Right? We gotta go to the tr this truck right here. Yeah, so let's go. Let's go to the truck. And, um... Yeah, let's go there first. Yeah, we're in all-wheel drive. That's good. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Don't get stuck down here, either. That's a massive place to get stuck. Oh, oh, oh. To the side, to the side. There we go. That's beautiful. Perfect. On the road, on the main road now. Well, I guess not main road, but one of the main roads. Cool. Let's let's drive by the main road just so that we don't really get stuck. You know, because we don't want to get stuck. And then we come up here. Yep. Gosh, this is a beautiful game as well. So gorgeous. Like, just look at all the like, look at the mud details and stuff. I love the game. I love this game. All right. Look at that GMC. Woo! She's party. Okay, so we now we... Oh, yeah, I keep forgetting. We have to use the pad to switch. So, change truck with the GMC. Great. All right, good. Now it's not the best truck for the job, but that will do. Okay, Steel River Township. Let's go ahead and... Ooh, handbrake. Let's go ahead and go over there. I believe we have to go in the middle of the town. So, I believe we have to go here. Because last time when I did lumber first, that wasn't fun to have to put all the lumber back. Okay, I marked it, right? No, I did not. Let's go ahead and mark it. Oh, we got to go to the fuel station first? Sure, I guess why not. Really? Thank you. Okay, fuel station first. Cool. Actually, nah. Nah. This is closer. We'll go to the steel first. I just noticed that the steel is closer. So we are going to want to go left over here. Nice. Oh, yep. Run over the sign. Oh, it didn't fall down. What's going on there? Okay. <laughs> going right through the trees. Alright, I'm not sure if that's meters or feet. Nah, that's probably meters. Yeah, that's probably meters. So, 200 meters away. Okay, we're almost there, actually. Then we gotta go drop it off at the bridge, and then we gotta go get some wood. And drop that off at the bridge. And then... Oh, not run over the sign. Oh, yeah, ran over the sign. Uh, and then we get to go across the bridge and find the garage. So, yay. Turn, turn, do not do that. Okay, and now we're going to have to somehow make it through this tiny opening. There we go. Better than I thought. Alright. Cool. Cargo management, we are going to need pretty much all of the steel. So, 
Now let's go to the bridge, which I believe. All right, let's go. Let's go mark it. Let's go mark the bridge. The bridge is right here. So we gotta go drop this off of the bridge. All right, are we still recording? Yep, still recording. It's working good. So we're gonna make a left here. Oh, oh, chill. Just calm down a little bit. Don't need to get so crazy with the with the steering there. Bye bye. Dang, it just sounds so good. I love the mist. Uh, no, we don't need gasoline. We're good on fuel. Water over road. You mean no road? You mean road underwater? Since that road goes down, if you put the road on top of the water, it'll all have been fine. Oh, oh, there we go. Push it out of the way. 55 is the speed limit. It don't tell me what, how fast I'm going. It just tells me my fuel consumption. It'd be nice to know how fast I'm going, though. Aren't we supposed to drop it off here? I thought we were. Is that on our tasks list? Oh, I didn't accept it. Oh, there we go. Yeah, do that. I already did that. Alright, cool. That's why it wasn't working. There we go. Look at that. Cool. Unload. Oh, yeah. Looking good. Now we need the wood. Let's go get some wood. Um, over this way, I believe. It is... Where's the wood? Oh, yeah, down here. We gotta go to the lumber mill. Uh, right there. Cool. Let's go get some wood, guys. Now it's raining. Uh, maybe, yeah, we should probably go down this way. This way might be a little easier to get down. Rain sounds good, too. I'm so happy I fixed my mic situation. Now I can actually listen to the games I'm playing. <laughs> Cabinet, this one's nice too. Looks really good. Ooh. There we go. Here we go. Lumber mill looks like the best place to get those wind blanks. I would assume it is because it's a lumber mill and it sells wood. All right. 
right, good job, good job. You're almost there. Oh yeah, let's get some new cargo. Um, I don't want both. Yeah, definitely gonna want both. Okay, now I gotta do it without getting stuck in the mud. Can't go that way. We will have to go this way. Careful. Okay, good job. Now we're gonna turn this way. And we do not want to flip over because if we lose any of this, we're gonna have to do it all over again. And uh takes a little bit to get to the wood. Okay, watch out for the water. Beautiful. Did it like a champ. Look at that, already back at the road. Let's go and drop these wooden planks off so we can go and get to our garage. Because that is where... Oh. That is where... It's going to be nice. Then we'll be able to customize the trucks and stuff. Oh, oh, watch out. Still got to get used to this uh, turning. It's not immediate turning. It's real turning. I like that. There you go. Cargo management and uh, unload. There we go. Look at that bridge. Oh, yeah. There we go. Cool. Thank you. So let's go. And now we can go to the garage. So let's go and find our garage, which I believe is all the way down here. Pretty far down. We don't need much gas yet, but we will in a bit. Whoa, watch out for the trees. Don't get stuck, buddy. There you go. I should probably start streaming this. This would be a pretty nice stream game, you know? Cool game just to sit down and talk to you guys with. I'll think about doing that. That'll be fun. If I did it, it would definitely be on my YouTube channel. Because um, I don't want to move over to Twitch, personally. I mean, I'll stream it to Twitch, too, but I don't really have any audience over there. Whoa, careful. Right through the water, perfect. And dang, here we are, already at our garage. That is pretty cool. And we found a truck as well. You have discovered your first garage. Nice. And a truck. 
get upgrade. Oh, sweet. Engageable all wheel drive. Nice. So, now. Here, I'll show you guys a quick tip how to fix that truck really fast. So, if we go to. Um, truck storage. Or, no. We have to move the trucks individually. Yeah, so. Let me go to my map. Okay, we gotta go to Alaska first then, I guess. Alright, let's go to Alaska. Then I want to show you guys. A quick little tip, you know? Let's just go to the garage. There we go. Alright. Cool. Now, can I use the local map? Yes, I can. Okay. Let's go back to Michigan. And we can go ahead and go to our garage. Thank you. Okay, now, uh, local map. Sweet. Okay, we can go to our K1500, and we can go ahead and get into that. And then we can go ahead and pull up the functions map and recover it. Send it to the garage. And then we can do that with... This one as well, the Fleet Star. And if once we recover it, as you can see, it has nothing right now, but if we recover it, there you go, it's all fixed. Now it's a working truck. See, I'll show you. Oh, we can go ahead and leave the garage. And now it's a working truck. See, before it didn't work, now it worked. That's all you gotta do. If you didn't know that already. Now we got some new trailers. Over here. Cool. Let's do this trailer too. Cool. Uh, I believe there is one more trailer as well. I don't know if it's over here or not. But there's one at a house as well. Ooh, what's this? Someone build a truck? See a nice little chassis there. Alrighty then. Still recording? Good. Cool. Let's go back to the garage. Alright, what customizations can we do with... Actually, do we want to use the Fleet Star or the GMC MH9500? That is the question. Um, I mean, the Fleet Star is pretty cool. But I want to know which one's like... Uh, here, go back. I want to know which one is like a little bit better, you know? So, power to rate ratio A, durability A-, minus, fuel consumption B... Let's go over here, customize A+, plus, B+, plus, and B+. Plus. So it has a little bit more power. If we wanted to, could we add a bed to this? I'm pretty sure we could. Um, yeah, so we can add a bed. We can add both types of beds. So we might... Just want to keep one of these and sell the other one. If we want to do that. But I don't know. Yet at least. What's that first bumper? Oh, that's a pretty cool bumper. Twin horn. External horn. Side thresholds. Probably don't want those right now, honestly. Angled sun visor. That looks good. Um, rims. Got a few options of rims here, huh? I think those look the best. An exhaust. I do like these the best. I like those a lot. Rear bumper. 
Nah, we're good there. What color should we do this? Red looks cool. That blue looks nice. Black. For now, we'll just leave it dark red. And the suspension, we do not have raised yet. Tires. Got 42 inches. Looking pretty good. Winch. It's good. Differential lock. Engageable spare wheel. We don't really need a spare wheel right now. Snorkel. We might actually need a snorkel. We'll get the snorkel. And engageable all-wheel drive. Beautiful. Now, frame add-ons. We will also add that flatbed we was talking about. And... I think we're good, honestly, for now. Let's test this thing out. Leave the garage. There we go. Looking good with the red, too. There we go. Dang, look up pretty good. Alright, well, I think this is where we will leave it in today's video. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I'm so excited about being able to record on an Xbox now because I've been playing Offered Outlaws for a while. Uh, I know I, I like I like the game still, but it's been getting kind of repetitive for me. So I like to be able to do something new for you guys, and uh, not even just SnowRunner. We can do other games like Forza, especially when, with the new Forza Horizon 5 coming out. That'll be fun to do. I'm definitely playing that on this channel. So uh, stick around if you want some of that, and also Dirt. You guys want dirt? We can play that. Some Xbox 360 games, too. Those will be fun. Some throwbacks. So, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I highly appreciate it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.